Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today I got a brand new video for you guys. We got a what's in my travel backpack and let's get right into it. So first off, I wanted to talk about this backpack. It's a Peak Design Everyday Carry Backpack from the 20 liter version. I was looking for something that, you know, has more space. I've always traveled with my North Face backpack, but I needed something where I can be more organized and this was the one that I picked out and researched about. So I had to try it out. Of course, there's a couple of ways to open it. We got the front pocket right here. And just pull it down, pull it out. It's magnetic and then it has like a clip to clip it on. And inside, of course, do that. And then there's also like the sides where you can open it from the side if you need to. Like that. It goes all the way down. But I'll get right into that pretty soon. And we also got this other side and then there's also in the back there's like a spot right here for your uh, macbook ipad and then whatever you have right here uh, right there so uh, this backpack is very durable very comfy i can put it on my carry-on suitcase and then the two side pockets of course right here all right so then first off i'm just gonna get this out of the way pretty self-explanatory always need to carry a water bottle wherever I go. I got this Hydro Flask 32 ounce water bottle. It holds up to, I'm pretty sure, 24 hours for cold and then 12 hours for um, hot. But usually I just get ice cold water. I love my cold water, so having this is a must when you're traveling, just cause you don't know, you're dehydrated. So just trying to stay hydrated and also, you know, keeps your water cold. So that's a plus. Of course, I've been having this for years now, so it's pretty beat up, but it does the job and helps me stay hydrated. All right. So then the next one I have, we'll do this back pocket right here. I have my iPad Pro. This is like the first generation, has only 64 gigs, but still works great. I have this case, this Logitech combo touch case, comes with the keyboard too. Like that and then you can prop it up if you want to while doing work I, I carry this because you know it's light it doesn't take up that much storage and just to get you know some work done like checking emails whatever i need to get done and usually when i'm traveling i just want to you know explore the city and not have to worry much about work so this is a must i also use this for youtube at night so when i get home to wind down and get ready for the next day. Usually watch some YouTube videos. I can take this out too if I want to, and then just use it as a regular iPad. But other than that, of course, the Apple Pencil Pro whenever I need it. This is pretty, you know, pretty light, light work, of course. And my next one that I have would be the MagSafe battery pack right here. Um, this is pretty useful just because when you're like exploring the city, whatever, you just put this on, charge your phone, don't have to worry about having a portable charger and then, you know the cables for it and of course it doesn't fully charge my phone but it gets to like 80 percent at least but it's almost low so works perfectly well so of course this is always essential next one it's like personal items of course i got my floss just in case because you know you never know you might need this comes in handy and then i also got the tie to go this one life changer I'm telling you guys must need when you're traveling because you never know you might get food stains whatever on your shirt especially white shirts i don't know why but i always have to make sure to have this everywhere i go just so i usually get some stain out of nowhere probably food whatever but this is a must and then next up in this pocket got my Ray-Ban sunglasses. Of course, when you're outside exploring the city or exploring wherever, must need sunglasses. So, you know, don't get blind by the sun. These are the one that I got. One of my favorite pairs right now, and I love them. So on this side, I got an open note. It's pretty easy access. So like using, you know, just want to get quick access and just pop it down and then there's a zipper and you just zip it down and then whatever you need, you have it right there. So this one, I got the Nintendo Switch. So usually I use this for like planes or like, you know, waiting for my, my flight. 
Uh, I got the case for it, of course, just to protect it. We got the Nintendo Switch OLED display. I usually play Legend of Zelda, uh, Tears of the Kingdom, Animal Crossing, whatever the case may be, but haven't been touching this too much, but trying to get back on it. So we got that right here, Nintendo Switch, whenever we need it. At the bottom part right here, I got my Bellroy Tech bag, essential, just because you don't want having things everywhere in your backpack. So just being more organized, that was like the whole plan of this backpack, just having it organized in ways where, you know, I don't have everything everywhere. For the tech bag, I got the, uh, the Anchor wall charger right here. Usually this charge up my, of course, the battery pack, portable chargers, my phone, of course, the iPad if needed. And then I got USB-A Type-C cable just to charge the battery pack and then some of my portable charger. I know I got a couple cords in here that just charges up my uh, portable charger. And this one's the uh, other one right here. And then I got my Apple Watch, of course. Apple Watch charger, essential, because I always wear my Apple Watch. Or if not, I have like a different watch, but my Apple Watch is a, one of the go-tos. And then of course, my USB-A to lightning cable um, for my phone. I'm still using the iPhone 14 Pro, but you know, I know now everyone is using, you know, USB-C, but I still have the lightning cable, so it does the job. Next one, of course, this pocket right here, we got the Anchor portable battery charger. I usually have like two of these just in case when I'm traveling with friends, family, whatever. They also need it, so always came, come prepared for that. Last but not least, I got the AirPods Pro right here. This is very easy. Just take it out, pop it in whenever you need it. Easy to use, has noise cancellation, transparency mode, always need this wherever I go. I'm gonna go this side right here. So we sit down. This one, I got my headphones, over the ear headphones. I recently picked this up not too long ago. It's the XM4, Sony XM4s. One of the most comfortable headphones out there. It was between this or the XM5, but a lot of people say the XM4 gets the job done so i have it here this one i use it for the plane of course always need this one because noise cancellation is top tier on this one and very comfortable it doesn't hurt my ears and i can listen to music non-stop lightweight too so on the side pocket i usually carry like a notebook a small notebook and also i have this g2 pen these are essentials to me when i'm traveling because I usually find inspirations when I'm at like coffee shops or wherever I'm at, wherever I'm at. And I always like to jot notes down on here just to get motivated, get inspired uh, to achieve all my other goals that I want to do in life. G2 pen, always a must, pretty easy to use. And then just a small notepad, um, it's very convenient, very easy to store, nothing too big, nothing too crazy. Of course, these are essential. Yeah, so these are my travel gears that i bring with me i'm excited to use this of course the peak design everyday carry backpack heard a lot of great reviews about it very durable comfortable and i'm pretty sure it's water resistant too if i'm not mistaken if you guys like to get any of these items i'll have the link in the description below it'll help me to make more videos like this i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure to like and subscribe for more videos that's coming out we got a lot more coming and i like doing these videos um, to showcase my you know kind of like tech and a little fashion here and there but other than that i'll see you guys in the next one peace